All right. Dear son, I wrote this at a time when your life had just begun and I addressed this to you, but perhaps it was me preparing for what's to come. And that leads me straight into lesson number one. Success is not measured in wealth. Having lots of cash does not mean you've won, especially if you take it without it being deserved. Yes, you must provide, but don't steal. Only take what you earn. And chase your dreams, because that is following your heart. Happiness is found when you play your true part. So don't chase money, just chase your passion. If you do what you love, it's funny, the money will happen. But son, work hard and give more than you get. If you put back more than you take, in the end, you will have no regret. And if you have enough, share the rest with others. The world's a much better place when you treat all man as your brothers. And be good to Mother Nature, make her want you back gladly. And that's a good thing, but the future needs you so badly and gladly. Rid of all your arrogance and vanity, because every time you lose it, you will gain more sanity. Because sadly, arrogance and greed, they're a common human virus. And that goes for me too. I'm not trying to preach and be all righteous. It's partly because I'm a sinner that I thought I should write this. I'm just trying to be a better man and practice my fatherly guidance. And it really hurts me to know that life will throw you the dark nights, but the feelings of relief, they only happen because of frights. And you will see some awful sights and take on so many plights, but beauty wouldn't exist without those god awful sights. And be careful with your words, whatever you read or write, they are dangerous weapons. And compared to physical pain, emotional strain, it leaves a much longer lasting impression. So if you've got nothing nice to say, just say nothing at all. But if they ask your opinion, you can be honest when answering that call. And make up your own mind. Don't be swayed by rumor. The grapevine, most of the time, is a very faulty ruler. And sometimes you might wonder why someone doesn't like you, but don't dwell on it. It's not worth it, and it's just not nice to. Unless you do something wrong, then you have to say sorry. It's okay to make mistakes, but put your wrongs right in a hurry. And sometimes people are acting due to envy. They're trying to hold you back, and they're never being friendly. But even to those types, you can't hold a grudge. Everyone's got their own fight, and you've got no right to judge. So keep the faith. I know this place can seem so remorseless. Some can't get a meal. Him down the street has got two different color Porsches. Of course, it comes down to human need and greed. It's part of our breed that makes us all want more than we need. So let your human have a being, but make sure your man is kind to all kinds, because black and white bleed red and see through green eyes. And don't think because people follow someone that they're a good leader, the sheeps and shepherds son, but some shepherds, they're just cheaters. But do respect the ones who take roles as good teachers because life's a big lesson and you need to be a receiver. I won't push you down a religion, but you need to be a believer. For something at least for all of this, I know there is a reason. And that's what's called faith. It's cemented by this love, father, son, mum, brother, over any other will ever come above. I love you, son. Thank you.